Well, good evening. Uh, I would like to uh, call the meeting to order and uh, first of all, thank all of you for coming. My name is Bob Gruber. I am the uh, current chair of the Board of Directors uh, for the next, I believe, 47 minutes. The number one priority has been and probably always will be serving the membership. It, it's the thing that no matter what happens, uh, the staff and the board bring it up. Are we serving the members? How are we serving the members? Is there any way that we can do it differently? For many years, there was talk of changing locations. Uh, this year, the board and the staff jumped in with both feet and signed a lease for new office facilities in Pewaukee. Bob and I, as he indicated, are continuing to collaborate with the AICPA, NASBA, the Accounting Examining Board, and other organizations to update Wisconsin's accounting regulations uh, and to develop a completely new model for CPA continuing education that will include shorter time increments and more types of creditable learning activities. So it won't be just lecture based as it has been for many years. I'm pleased, very pleased actually, to welcome the uh, 10, 25, and 40 year longevity members in attendance this evening. And obviously, congratulations on your accomplishments as members of the WICPA, and thank you for your continued uh, support. It is our honor this evening to recognize the 2014 WICPA Excellence Award recipients. This year, we have eight outstanding individuals who have been nominated by their peers for their accomplishments and achievements over the years. This evening we recognize Joel Nettesheim as a recipient of the Public Service Award. Lawrence Alzum as a recipient of the Business and Industry Award. Barbara Schutz as a recipient of the Educator Award. Representative Dale Kuyenga as a recipient of the Outstanding CPA in Government Award. Michelle Hicks Tobias as a recipient of the Spirit Award. Megan Schultz as a recipient of the Outstanding Young Professional Award. Karen Kerber as the recipient of the Achievement Award. Lastly, we recognize Joanne Cross as a recipient of the Distinguished Career Award. These are the nominees for the Board of Directors for the WICPA for 2014-2015. The slate of nominees has been approved and I think a round of applause would be appropriate. Every five years, the WICPA does a strategic plan, and it basically gives an opportunity to evaluate the compass on where the WICPA is moving. I just want everyone in this room to understand that you do have a voice in this process, so please feel free to contact myself, the WICPA staff, or any board member, because the feedback to this being a successful process is critical. Again, thank you very much for the opportunity to be your board chair, and I will work very hard to assist you and the WICPA membership this coming year. Excellent. Excellent.